What's up guys, Goro here and welcome to the brand new Missy's Mission series. That is absolutely correct. We have a player specific road to glory hitting us on YouTube once again. It has been a while since we've done anything like this over here. So for the remainder and for the course of EAFC 24, we are going to take Missy Bokerns, one of the best Liverpool women's players. Um, sadly, not got the best card, but with the brand new evolutions in EAFC as well for this year, we are going to try and take her and make her the best possible card that we can using every type of evolution available to us. So, without further ado, we're going to hop straight into things. If you guys are new to the channel, don't forget to leave the video a like, rating, comment, subscribe for more content like this. There is also going to be pack openings on the channel, but for now, we have a dedicated series to Missy Bokerns. So let's go hop into the web app. So here we are then into the start of the web app. As you can see, I have not even touched this account one second. I've obviously logged in because I kind of have to do that. But we are going to be able to start things off. Now, we're obviously going to take England as our nation because Missy Bokerns is English. Because we're going to work towards Liverpool players, it's probably the easiest thing to do. Now, originally, I wanted to start this on Xbox. We're about 24 hours away from being able to play the physical game on Xbox. However... I'm just too addicted. I'm, I'm far too addicted. And I just, I want to make the most of this account. So because of that, we're going to try and make the most of account. We need to buy Missy Bokerns. So that's what we're going to try and do today. The whole point of today is to try and get hold of her, do all the basic stuff. And then by tomorrow, by the time you actually watch the next episode of this, we'll be actually on the game, playing the game, testing the evolutions out. Who knows what we're going to do. So Starting things off, we are going to go with England. It is the easiest option for us to go with. In terms of our team, I mean, again, her would be nice, but we sadly don't. We are going to get a good few English players that will help us out for SBCs. Now, in terms of who we are going to take as loan cards, I think the best option, after looking through all of them on the main accounts, I'm going to take Kyle Walker. Now, we can take Trent, and it's a good option, but Kyle Walker gives us more games and he's a bit of a better card. So we're going to take Kyle Walker. I think that's a good option. Once we actually get onto the game, we'll have more loan cards from the founders packs and all of that type of stuff. So starting things off here, we are going to go with that. Now, originally, I was hoping to get like the full Liverpool setup here. Sadly, we aren't going to. We're going to start off, though, with Inter Miami FC. Now, a very nice kit and also one that we can sell on to try and make some coins at the start of the game. Into the away kit. Again, no Liverpool here. Again, sadly, Arsenal would sell. Chelsea will sell. LA Galaxy is a very nice kit. I'm actually going to take Chelsea. It is quite harsh and quite sad to take Chelsea, considering it's a Liverpool player we're doing the series on. But that is okay. And then our badge, we will take Real Madrid. Of course we will. It's one of the best teams you can get. So that is starting off the account. That's the basis for this team. However, as I say, we need Missy Bokern. So EA telling us, obviously, not to transfer coins. We, we can get away with that. Let me go and check out the transfer list and see if we can actually get her. So with a quick search on to the market... Missy Bokerns is available right now. We have 44 minutes to try and obtain at least 1,400 coins if we can. Now, I am going to watch this card because in the next 44 minutes, I'm going to make sure that I can get her sorted. Now, you may be wondering, well, how do you do that? Now, at the start of the game, it's quite difficult to do that. If you just go straight over into the stadium section and go to your club, thankfully, EA do provide extra little badges here and there. So, we can send all of our extra items you know all of this type of stuff for now we're just going to use the basic of basic kits just to allow us to actually use the cards that we need to um, and to sell them on so the inter miami kit is worth about 400 350 coins this isn't actually worth anything however we are going to discard it for 227 coins i know can't really make the coins out of it now the chelsea kit doesn't also have too much value to it again it's probably going to be another kit that we have to quick sell. Again, it's going to sell on for around 500 coins. We may as well just take these coins as it stands. So 712 coins as it is. If we go back to the badges, does the Real Madrid badge sell? Now, I have a feeling, again, a lot of people are in the same position. Again, most of this is quick selling on. So we currently have 1,200 coins, nearly. Let's go and try and make some more of that with either objectives or with some SBCs. So then, with a tiny little bit of grinding, we have started to do some of the squad maintenance. What this does allow us to claim is, we've already claimed the bronze pack here. Um, that was just so I could obviously get that sorted and just get that boxed off. But, we now have 150 coins to claim. So that's a start. And then, the one that's more important, it gives us the coins that we need. That's another 100 coins here. So, no matter what, we can put a bid on Missy Bokerns. Now, I don't know whether it's worth putting a bid on her right now. 
because we still have 40 minutes to wait. I think I want to play this out. If we need to, we can obviously just go ahead and buy it. That's absolutely fine if we get the 5,000 coins. But you know what? I just need to make some more coins up right now. So let me try and make some more coins up. Let me go and start by doing all of these SBCs and then we'll start opening these packs as well. So then like everybody has to, we actually have done all of these SBCs. Now I've just literally chucked in the bronze players that we have in the club. Obviously now we're going to be able to go open a load of bronze packs to replenish the club to then continue on doing all the basic foundation stuff now also we have the availability to transfer some cards if we need to the two rare player pack it's not all rares one card is rare so hopefully we get something from it so as i say all of the bronze packs are just going to replenish the club it's going to give us the consumables that we need to obviously add things to players in case obviously there's objectives for it so that's okay um as i say we're not going to be able to pack Missy Boker and saying these packs, but there is a silver packs. Now, if we are able to pack her, then that makes life a hell of a lot better. We are able to do two evolutions on her, and um, we will be doing that next episode when we can actually play the gameplay. So I will show you them, but we do not have to use just a 74 rated rare silver, which is very nice. Obviously, we're going to start building a team around her. So in the next 24 hours after we finish today's video, we are basically going to try and make as many coins as I can. Then from there, the coins that we do make we then go ahead and put into the team. Now, there's, again, a few different options that I want to do right now for cards. Um, plenty of stuff here. Now, this is all tradable, so I am going to send it all to the club. However, we could look at starting to sell some of this on as well to make some coins, so I can obviously do, do that in the background. Obviously, the silver pack isn't going to give us anything good. It's absolutely fine. It's just more players for me to use. And as I say, um, hopefully within the next sort of 24 hours of actually starting this account up, we are able to obtain multiple different players to link to Missy Bokerns to make the team better, to then take it into rivals. And then next week, we are going into weekend league with this team. So our first big pack of the day is going to be a half decent left back. I actually can't complain that, that. we also get um, Philippe. Again, it's a goalkeeper from the women's league. We're probably never going to use it, but... This left back from Bayern actually is half decent, will give us some decent links as well. So it's a good start. It's now a case of we need to make some more coins. So let me continue on grinding out this game and getting everything sorted for us. So then another part of these SPCs are complete. It is just foundations to getting completed. However, it allows us to get a premium loan reward, which is nice. And then on top of that, we can go ahead over to the objectives. I have completed a few extra things and claimed them as well. But we get the first good pack on this account, a two rare gold player pack. Now, these normally pay out pretty well, especially at the start of the game. So hopefully we can obtain something. Obviously, again, all these bronze cards are just going to allow me to complete all these SBCs. Now, I'm not showing them just because it's kind of a waste of your guys' time in all honesty. 250 coins here is phenomenal. That takes us already up to 2,000 coins. Now, yes, maybe a week ago I would have said 2,000 coins is nothing. But right now, 2,000 coins is everything to us sadly no coins in there but that's absolutely fine the main thing that we're going to need now from bronze packs is plays from the same league nations and clubs is obviously what's going to help us but with having the coins it shouldn't be too bad for us a red um, stadium team is actually quite nice with the fact that we are going to go a bit liverpool theme with everything here obviously 100 coins again is very much accepted we do not mind that whatsoever so we're slowly getting towards that 5,000 coins which Probably is going to be quite useful for us um, if we need to buy it. Bonu, a nice goalkeeper just to start off with. Again, with the fact that we're probably not going to have too many good cards to start off with in our first few games, I'm not going to complain at that. If we need to use him, we're going to use him. If we have no chemistry on our cards, then that's absolutely fine. We'll have to roll with the blows. But again, another few decent little cards coming in there as well to help us out. Slowly filling up the club, especially with consumables in terms of contracts and all that type of stuff is ideal. And then the first big pack of this account, maybe our first card that's really going to stay in the team. It is going to be not a team of the week, but it is going to be a Serbi. That's definitely going to help us out for some SBCs along the line. And then Fernand Torres is very nice. Again, another very good card, very cheap, but I think we have the ability to do some evolutions with him if we wanted to. For now, I'm going to leave it. We're going to focus on evolutions, as I say, in tomorrow's video. But Missy Bokerns is still there. She is still there at that price of 1400 Now, I don't want to put a bid on her yet. She is the only card available, which is absolutely fine. So 20 more minutes of me just grinding out the game, and let's see if we actually get her. So we're done with Foundations 3, which means, again, some more decent packs to fill the club. 
and another two red gold players pack. Now that is just going to be the theme of the next sort of five to ten minutes of it's the same packs. It's been the last few same packs that we're getting into the club. It just allows us to complete different objectives, different SBCs here, there and everywhere. Hopefully in the bronzes like this, we're getting some coins. And then hopefully in the silvers, we can also get a few more coins because they sometimes can pay out 500 coins per pack, which again is very, very helpful right at the start of the game. So do we have any coins? We don't in this one, but that's absolutely fine. A lot of nations of players which are going to help us out to continue on the grind. So we get two silver packs to open. Again, these could give us a half decent usable card at the start of the game. Um, they're probably not going to. We don't get anything in that one, which is absolutely fine. Just plenty of players and consumables. And then into the second one, again, not going to be anything else. Again, you don't really expect it at the start of the game. The whole point of today and the whole point of this video is purely to obtain the card that we are going to use for the rest of FIFA. Because, I mean, without Missy Bokerns, we can't really do too much. But the second one of the two rare gold player packs, again, Fernand Torres last time was good. Balde this time is very nice. In terms of Lincoln to Torres, is very, very good as well. Um, sadly, Madissa, not great, but isn't bad off the bench. Balde is very nice, though. Again, probably not super expensive as it stands right now, but that's absolutely fine because if we just head over to our squad, obviously, I've been sort of adding in a few players here and there as we go. Sadly, the chemistry part is bugged. Um, I'm not too sure why EA have done it but for the 12 and 18 chemistry it doesn't actually work so a bit of a shame with that but Fernand Torres and Balde are definitely going to be two cards that we are using in our first bit of gameplay get links to each other they're going to help each other out very nicely so before I go and do anything further the annual check on Missy Bokerns she is still the only one 18 minutes left so let's carry on grinding so then we have a minute left we are finally going to do it. We're going to put that bid on Missy Bokerns to go and pick her up. But that is confirmed. So now it's just purely a case of counting down the clock until we can actually add her into the club. And so here we are with 10 seconds left. It's actually been able to be quite easy to get Missy Bokerns. Yes, it's taken me the 40 odd minutes that we saw her at first to build up what we needed. But with a bit of a refresh, I'm hoping that this... Is going to be our first player to add to the club. Missy Bokerns is officially in the club. Missy Bokerns is officially starting the series around her. Missy's mission, as you can tell by the by the squad name, the club name will be changed as soon as we are able to. Um, sadly, just the fact that EA don't allow you to do it on web app is a little bit frustrating. But she is the staple of this team now there are obviously a few players i want to work towards now with the fact that we've got torres and balde obviously this opens a lot of opportunities to us and um, we are slowly going to work to a few more liverpool players i would like john matip for an evolutions i would like to get hold of i think we can also pick up um darwin nunez so over the next sort of 24 hours over the next sort of time period that you guys aren't going to see you can check it out on stream as you're watching this video we are going to be live over on Twitch. Links are down below to everything to come and check it out. We're just going to be trading. We're going to be trying to make as many coins as we can, doing all the basic SBCs and stuff. But we're in a pretty good place. I am very, very happy to say that it is going well. We've got two silver packs, a gold pack, and then we'll also do our preview pack to finish things off with. Hopefully, we're going to maybe make the coins that we need to. I can't guarantee if we're going to or not. Um, but I think the, the next aim is to go ahead and pick up Maybe a Matip for the Evolutions, or maybe we go ahead up and try and pick up Darwin Nunes. He is going to be expensive, so it's one that we can work towards. But I am super excited about this series. As I say, we haven't done something like this for maybe a year or two right now. Um, and it is something that I enjoy. I enjoy being able to show you guys with a little bit of time in the game, with no money, you can achieve some things. So, one of the first goal packs that we've got. It is going to be another La Liga player, um, which isn't too bad. We also get the PSG Tifa, which is quite nice. We get Pedro Neto, which is not a bad left mid, although we already have a left mid, so kind of a little bit frustrating. A Spanish manager, we also get a Hunter, a Gladiator, and a Finisher. Now, this is actually going to help us out in somewhat of a way um, to complete some more of the objectives. And then, as I say, to finish things off, to round things off for episode number one. Yes, it's probably been a bit boring, but... As soon as we can get onto that game, episode number two will be out for you guys. So finishing off the preview pack. Do we need to get 7.5k coins? Luis Alberto isn't bad. Sadly, not too good. 
Again, anything in behind, not really going to help us out. A Hawk is quite nice at the start of the game, but apart from that, yeah. I think we're going to let this preview pack run out. For now, that is where we're going to leave it for today, guys. I'm out. Peace.